V15PN screen tester, operation video, power on the V15PN through plugging or a battery. Take out the screen to be tested and the corresponding screen test FPC. Down with the gold finger of the FPC and buckle it on V15PN. Connect MIPI screen to the MIP IFPC interface. Buckle the screen on the screen test FPC. Click lighting. After lighting up the screen, click the color section on V15PN. The corresponding color is displayed on the screen to be tested. You can check if there are any dead pixels on the screen by observing the above colors. This is image section. Through observing the image, you can check if there is abnormal part on the screen. Click on the right side of the screen to switch to the next built-in image. Through different images, you can check if there is abnormal part on the screen. Click the touch section. We can test if there is screen touch failure in this section, such as unresponsive touch on part or all of the screen. Multi-touch gesture is not working, inaccurate touch behavior. Support multi-finger touch operation. Up to five finger touch operation is available. Click clear. We can erase the touch traces on both screens. Click the simple touch test section. Effectively improve the screen test efficiency. Click clear to erase the touch traces. This is RGB color section. Click the RGB color section, then adjust the RGB primary colors until the screen is adjusted to any color you need. Test screen dead pixels. We can also adjust the cool and warm colors below to further check the screen. True tone is at the upper right corner. Click to turn on the true tone. Click last to jump to the last color. Click next to jump to the next color. Click Auto Cycle. Select Cycle Type. Select Cycle DC. It will play the above sections clockwise on the screen. Click Cycle Stop to stop loop playing. Click Cycle RC. The screen will loop play the above sections counterclockwise. Click Cycle Speed to adjust the speed of playing. Click Test Type. Refresh Rate Test. The Refresh Rate Test can support up to 1 to all HC. Click Test. If there is no frame dropping, it means the screen supports 1 to all shade high refresh. If there is frame dropping, it indicates that the screen doesn't support 1 to all shade high refresh. Click Stop to stop testing. We can also adjust the playback speed. Click PLC DIY. We can customize the image for the image section. Connect the USB drive, then click load picture. The method for the USB image folder can be carried out according to the above steps. Click more. Click check update. It will automatically update to the latest version of maybe. Click add pop date. It will automatically update to the latest version of EDP. Click ADC warning. We can set the alarm current limit value for backlight, display and touch. For example, we set the backlight alarm current to 140 milliampers. Egg. Then increase the screen brightness. If the backlight current exceeds the set limit value, it will remind us. Just now we set it to prompt only when the current exceeds the alarm limit. So after exceeding the limit value, it only prompts and does not turn off the screen. Then we set the alarm current to prompt and extinguish the screen. Egg. It prompts and turns off the screen after exceeding the alarm current. Click Multi Machine. Select the same channel under the same Wi Fi for multiple devices. Then they can operate synchronously. It enables to connect up to 256 devices at the same time. There is also the brand check function. Click BTND. Customize the color block function and image display on the home page of V15PN. You can adjust the color block function and image displayed on the main interface according to your own needs. There is also gesture switch function. Click on the left side of the screen to switch to the next color section. Click on the left side of the screen to switch to the last color section. Click on the screen with two fingers to switch to the screen touch section. 
Click again with two fingers to switch to the simple touch section. Click again with two fingers to exit. Double click with two fingers to light off the screen.